There may be a long legal road ahead for three women who allegedly tried to speed away from a car in South Bear County from sheriff's deputies. That's right, Ursula. All three eventually were caught in West Bear County early this morning on Shanefield Road, not far from Wild Horse Parkway. As Katrina Reber reports, it marked the end of a wild encounter that also included a broken window on a patrol car. A call about an assault at a West Bear County home left the sheriff's deputy's SUV showing some scars. The deputy had just arrived around 3.30 this morning at the home on Round Ridge Street, where a woman allegedly beat her boyfriend with a mason jar. A sheriff's supervisor says the 18-year-old woman had called two friends to pick her up, and as they left, one of them smashed the back window on the deputy's patrol car. He went after them and called for help. You can tell from all the glass here in the street that that window took a beating and is in need of some major repairs. As for the man who was beaten, deputies tell us he suffered minor injuries. Another deputy, meanwhile, had spotted the car with the women on Shanefield Road and stopped it. But that apparently didn't stop one of them. Deputies say the 18-year-old involved in the assault also is to blame for this car ending up on the curb that she tried to get away again as they took her and her friends into custody. They say she was able to slip out of her handcuffs and jump behind the wheel. Ultimately, though, all three women got a ride to jail. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News.